Hey everyone, Dan here. If you're a world traveler and you travel around, you probably have run into the case where you forgot to set the date and time on your camera. Keep in mind your camera keeps the date and time from wherever you set it. So let's say you live in Portland like me, you set your time and your time zone to Portland, then you travel somewhere else, you take pictures, when you come back, it records the date and time of what it was in Portland. That doesn't really help me if I was shooting across the country and the time was different. So I'm going to show you how to use the edit capture date feature to adjust the time to actually what it was for the local time. So I have a batch of photos here. They're all three hours off. It shows them as being shot at 11 o'clock in the morning when they're actually shot at eight o'clock in the morning. So here's what you do. You select all the photos from that shoot, all the ones that have the wrong date and time on them. And then you can right click and use the edit capture date dialog. Now here, you can either set a very specific date if you want to, or you can adjust by time zone. This is what I'll do. So I'll select the time zone option. It shows me the date and time for the currently selected photo, and then it shows what the corrected date and time is gonna look like. So I know these were three hours too fast, so I can adjust it. So instead of saying 1119, it's now 819. I hit okay, it's gonna go through and it's gonna change the metadata for all of those selected photos by three hours. There's a third option in here called set to create date. Sometimes files have their metadata stripped and they don't actually have a capture date in them or the capture date could have been damaged by some other application and may not be valid. So using the create date option, we'll look at the file creation date at the operating system level, which is always there. All right, we hit okay and bada bing. Now when we look at our files, if we look over here at the capture date and time, you'll see now it's 820. And as I move through these, you can see how the date and time all adjusts by three hours all in a relative fashion, just like that. All right, thanks for watching.